Hi, we're here at the Noah Webster House and we are at the exhibit called People, the Heart of Connecticut. I am so privileged and honored for all the people who have come and participated and are featured in this exhibit. And ultimately, it's just such a great moment in time to capture, and we really captured the things that mattered, which is our families, our communities, and our stories. And it's just been such a privilege and an honor to be able to feature all the people in this exhibit. My name is Marcel Applewaite. I am honored and humble to be a part of this exhibit. Becca actually found me. So I went online and looked at some of her stuff and I was appreciative of the work that she had done previously. I went to her studio. I had the ability to see some of her work I didn't quite appreciate the work that she did until I came here to the gallery at the Noah Webster house because there's something about taking a picture and then personalizing it and making it into a portrait. So I don't know who this woman is in the picture. I know it's me. However, she pulled something out of me that I don't think I realized was inside of me. And I believe that um, her skill and her talent to draw out the best in people in a visual way um, is evident by all of the portraits that are here in this gallery today. This is a skill that not many people can do. And I am beyond um, overwhelmed at the idea of being a part of this and having something that I will be able to pass down for generations. So in the midst of all the crazy COVID stuff and the crazy uh, world we are dealing with, with race relations, to get something good out of it always gives me hope. I always will always hope that things will be better because if we don't have hope, we really don't have much of anything. So this wonderful gallery and the showing actually shows that there is hope and goodness in this world. It was my first professional photo shoot. Some of us do not appreciate a portrait that has been painted. There's some subtle things in here that I see in myself that she didn't get rid of, which shows me that she was really paying attention to detail and she took what was actually a picture and actually made it into the, rea the reality. But, you know, she calls it digitally enhancing, but I'm not sure because I think she just figured out what the best thing was, you know, and she was able to bring out the best in me. This has been such a rare and special time for all my clients because they have been able to meet each other and see each other's portraits and create friendships and community and it's just been such a wonderful privilege to be able to be a part of this. If you want to see more of my work, you can go on www.rebeccaroseveinportraits.com or I am on Instagram at Rebecca Rose Fine Portraits.